Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. This is uh, Dr. Ahmadullah Qureshi, and uh, I am going to show slides indi indicating the morphological adaptations of various uh, plant groups like uh, hydrophytes, halophytes, xerophytes, and then lithophytes. These are four major uh, morphological uh, distinguished species. And these are mostly uh, governed with the uh, with the nature of uh, moisture regime available in the area, and likewise there are certain morphologies found in plants. So xerophytes, those species which are growing in dried habitat or semi-dried habitat, these are known as xerophytes. So there are uh, important uh, uh, features found in these species like uh, succulents. Succulents means uh, there is a uh, fleshy uh, organs found in species. And then uh, these species may have no leaves or having a seasonal small leaves. And then leaves with hairs, waxy coating and spines. They have prolonged root system uh, in search of water uh, uh, from various uh, uh, soil profile. Then they have short life cycle. Most of the species are those which are unable to survive in harsh climatic conditions. So these are also known as a drought skipper. So these species have very uh, short life cycle uh, maybe just uh, three to four weeks they they complete their life cycle and uh, sharing their seeds in the soil and uh, bulk of the area remain uh, barren and they are slow growing so that's why they require less energy so you can see first species this is uh, prosopis cineraria it is also known as a chan in Sindh, but in Sindhi, it is known as a kandi, but in Punjab, it is known as a chan. Then this is a tamaric sapila. It's a, known as a frash or khagal or lau in local language. This is a salvadora olvidis. It is known as a van uh, in Punjab, but uh, in khabar and jar, it is known in uh, Sraiki as well as in Sindhi language. This is Caliconum polyconoides. It is known as a folk. This is Arva Jamanica. Uh, it's a soft nature. It's a fibrous nature. It can be called as a desert uh, cotton. And this is Caparis decidua. Decidua means leaves are seasonal and they are deciduous in nature. They fall uh, before maturity. And this is a Deptrichum glacum. This is known as a uh, pear in Sindhi language. This is uh, Crotleria uh, bruhia. It is known as a chug locally. Again, this is Crotleria bruhia. This is Calotropus procera. It has succulent leaves. This is Euphorbia caducifolia. And this species is a calcium loving species. Uh, mostly it is uh, uh, found in Khipro, Sangar and Karachi as well as Makran coast area and on the top you may see the single gymnospomic species desert oriented that is known as a Ephedra cilia. This is uh, Acacia jacumontae. This is again Tameric Safila. This is uh, Acacia jacumontae. Momordica balsamina. This is Calotropus procera, Caparis decidua, Crocleria brugia, then Vidinia somnia. Tocumus profiterum, Trichodesma indicum. This is Launia procumbens, and this is Casia sina. This is uh, Sambopogon javarancosa, and uh, this is Stipa gracius plomusa, uh, very small grass. Then uh, these are halophytes. Halophytes are those species which, uh, which uh, uh, possess fleshy uh, plant organ with succulent leaves and stem. And uh, in certain areas like in uh, Arabian Sea, there are mangroves. 
they 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 possess uh, nematophore roots, special air roots which grow directly into the air, which have many lenticels allowing entry of oxygen. But in uh, uh, slime, sodic glands, you may see uh, Sudafruticusa, like this is uh, shown here. And uh, these are succulent nature. They uh, accumulate salt. Uh, then these are actually potash or sodium salts. This is uh, Salsola imbricata. This is uh, Suda ruticosa. This is Desmostachia bipinnata, highly uh, salt tolerant uh, grass in all the plain areas where there are uh, their pH level is uh, over than eight. And then uh, this is uh, Zygophyllum propinquum. It is present on the uh, coastal area. This is uh, Phragmitis carca, highly uh, uh, high level of uh, halophyte and this is uh, Elluropus legupoides it is also uh, halophyte then hydrophytes those species which are adapted to to live either partially or fully submerged in the water and uh, water lily is a very common example that is one of the even nymphia alba and nymphia lotus so these species possess large thin floating leaves they have elongated petiole uh, this is actually petiole and then re they reduced uh, uh, root system uh, or in other words uh, they have shallow rooted root uh, shallow shallow rooted root system and they have aerial flowers little or no wax cuticle poorly developed xyl uh, xylem tissues and little or no lignin in so you can see this is lemphia lotus and it is known as a bullion nilofer uh, it is its root is even uh, used in uh, uh, synth as a vegetable that is known as a bay this is uh, typha uh, domain genesis uh, it is a highly uh, water loving or moisture loving plant and this is uh, uh, Shen plectus littoralis, another sedge uh, which is very commonly found in all, in almost all the wetlands. Again, you may see bulbul shenis uh, affinis and uh, then uh, Shen plectus littoralis. Along uh, the border, you may see uh, typha and then Phragmitis carca. And on this uh, uh, lower side, you may see. Uh, see uh, Phragmitis uh, australis. This is Bukan uh, that is known as a phyla nodiflora. It is a uh, uh, water loving or uh, uh, moisture loving plant. This is Eclipta prostrata. It is also known as a Dariai booty. Uh, it is uh, highly uh, wet loving this species. Then uh, those species which are found on the rock especially these are known as a lithophytes so this is a very large uh, uh, straggler found uh, almost uh, coastal area as well as kirtha range uh, that is uh, caperus cartilaginea this is uh, barbaris lyceum this is merva caracifolia that is uh, uh, climbing on uh, zizipus mauritiana both his species are calcium loving species this is uh, Pigonia brugieri. This is uh, Razia stricta, and uh, it is uh, purely uh, calcium loving and rock loving. This is Caregna ambigua, mostly found in uh, Ziarat and uh, those areas. This is Otostagia limbeta. Its distribution is uh, starting from Potwa region up to the uh, low or uh, sub Himalayan region. This is Ifuna granitoides, highly calcium loving species. It's a succulent in nature and highly aromatic species. This is uh, Shivinfurthia papilionacea. This is uh, Eloxilan stoxii. This is Edatoda vesica, Baker. 
this is uh, solena melancholium it is uh, reported earlier in literature from balochistan and we recorded it from a uh, color card this is rubia manchit it is climber uh, mostly found in moist temperate areas this is uh, uh, debrigesia salicifolia this is uh, erisima jacumontae this is lumex uh, hestrid this is uh, equilatia pubiflora mostly found in moist temperate uh, area like in uh, uh, this is geranium uh, valicianum found in uh, uh, Murray, then uh, Uvia, Nathia Gali, and Thandia.